Good morning. It is Monday the 3rd of January and we are in York and a couple of my American friends said that they wanted to see the shambles in York. So I'm at the top and the first thing I've seen to do with the Harry Potter game is this guitar shop that's called Barghest, which was one of the characters brought up in the story. So that was weird. But, uh, now we'll start our walk down the shambles. The mask might be on and off. Rollo's fudge pantry. I've just popped in there to get myself some fudge. Shambles Tavern. And you can see how close the how small the street is. York Ghost Merchants. No, it's not open yet. We should the um, Monk Bar Chocolates, which unfortunately isn't open. At the bottom of this street we've got the two Harry Potter stores, so we'll have a look at those. Whitby Jet Shop. Hope you can hear me okay. Carry on this in a minute, I'll just go and return that call. So I've just I've just told my husband where to meet us and we'll carry on with our tour. So we've got British Wall and Cashmere Shop. York Vikings. Wow, look at this. Maybe we gotta go. It's like a cool shop. Mrs. B's Emporium of Gifts. And we've got a little saffron, which looks like a trinket shop. The cheesecake guy, again, sadly that's closed. Edinburgh Woolen Mill, which is a generic shop. Let's uh, turn around again and see the actual street itself. Just like uh, something out of Harry Potter, isn't it? Uh, some of my Christmas loving friends might go to this shop. Nutcracker Christmas shop. It's now January, so we're a bit past it, but I think this is uh, open all the time. I would go in there, but I think we're going to get quite a bit of video going around the Harry Potter shop, so what's this one? The shop? That must not be named. We'll finish off the, uh, we'll carry on going down, and then we'll come back to the Harry Potter shop. Hebden tea. You can get a hot tea to, to go out. It's like a nice shop, doesn't it? Oh, I think this used to be, this used to have Harry Potter stuff. Galaxy, but that's closed. Shambles Kitchen. Sandwiches and Slender Fast Foods. And then... The last one down here, which looks interesting, is the Enchanted Galaxy. Looks like it's got American sweets. We'll have a little look round there and then I'll, t I'll let you know when we're uh, going in the Harry Potter shop. Right, we have our mask on now and we're in the Enchanted Galaxy shop. And we have lots of chocolate over here. Do you know it brands though? We have the British Arm Iron, the Harry Potter books, Ravenclaw. I wonder what that is. Is it an eagle? Puffle Puff and the Badger. 
No Slytherin snake though. Do you want to see a trick with them? Yeah. So, yeah, they come together. You've got your little lion. Yeah. Uh, let's see. It's, uh, it's lined on the inside. So you can actually put stuff in. Cool. But the little trick is always, good night, Mr. Lion. <laughs> and then he goes. Cool. Thank you. I like it, it's cute. Fantastic view. And the telephone box to get into the ministry. Is that a notebook? Big Harry Potter crest. And are these ones? I think these are ones. What is this? Hermione Granger bag. Oh, the extending bag. So that's it, look. We've got a picket there. And Demi Guys. Hello. Mandrake, Grindelow, more cups, and then over here we've got more ones. Oh wow, look at this. £23. Not, they're not labelled who's they are, but... This is Van Weasley's. Percival, Percival Graves. Death Eater Wand. Neville. Whose wand would you go for? Fantastic Beast, Nukes Commander. Wow. Let's go and have a look at the sweets. Excuse the music. I think in the other shop they might have some every flavour beans. The portion shop that I was thinking of is closed. But here we're going in the shop that must not be named on the shambles in York. Yeah. Hi. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Playing cards. Oh, we've got the Harry Potter music in the background. Some Christmas stuff on sale. Hope you can hear me okay through the mask. Look at this. Wizarding World Christmas Stocking Kit. Reduced to £22.49. Sorting hat decoration. Oh, we've got the same magical creatures as that was in the other shop. And we've got a headwig here. Some cards. Posters. Yeah. 
99. It looks more like a children's size dressing gown. Champions One collection. Oh wow, look at this. It's like a pop art book. It doesn't say what that is. The main is bag again. Oh wow, look at that snow globe. That's amazing. Hogwarts Express. Uh, oh, a 3D puzzle of Diagonal Alex. What's that? Busy shop. Here we've got some crockery. Uh oh, I'm getting tired. A magical year. I've seen this book online. A spellbinding moment for every day from J.K. Rowling's Harry Potter novels. Control the flow in the shop. Oh, look at this. A guided journal for embracing your inner Hufflepuff. Oh, they've got the cushions again. We've got uh, we've got oh, one. someone from America from the you know the university. We're probably we're gonna we are gonna get some more ones in. Yes, she's just confirmed they are out of stock of the beans. Never mind. Oh, sorry, yeah, just popped it down there. This shop is pretty amazing. Look at all the stuff up here. Right, I think we'll end with a photo. Good morning, I forgot to look at the time. What time is it? It's quarter past 11 and we are having coffee before we get back in the car. So we are outside the Lucky Days Cafe, which is on the main thoroughfare through York. Marks and Spencer's is just there. And when our coffee's come, I'll show you what we get. How are you all? I wish you all a happy new year and uh, maybe see you soon. Right, so we have fruit toast with butter. 
Americano with milk. Andrew's got a double chocolate muffin and a pot of tea. Uh, Yorkshire tea. Yeah. Yum. Enjoy. Thanks for watching and like I say, maybe I'll see you again soon.